what is Magic Carpet 64? And in the last episode, we talked to that guy, but we didn't get anything. Because he's a jerk. Come on, man. I'm getting this. I'm getting this. No, it's just me. What you have to do is... Well, you'll see in a minute. So you want to come out here. You want to go down. At... Okay. But basically, out of this whole desert, you want to go to the bottom right. Why it's like a coin. And then we'll just start staying green like that. That means you're going to the right place. And you we are here. Not too much. But that was a lime. That one is not required, but but here, you, if you don't get this, unless you're actually just trying to do this real like you're challenging yourself really good. You have to get this. Okay, it basically powers up your partners. I believe it only powers. Uh, I believe it only gives them a new move to use in this game. But, I'll have to check on that. but in Paper Mario TTYD, it gives them more health than more power, and it gives them a new. So yeah. So, okay, so, but what you have to do here is required. You have to hit that tree and get that one. That is re re That is required. So just right. So come over here. I'm 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 Okay, so you came over here. Okay, so, what I wanna do is go back to the jerk. I'm just gonna eat it. It's just a little mouse thing. First. Okay, sure, I'll give, I'll give you a lemon. All you have to do is get. I'll just be mouse. If I miss a mouse, go to the shop in this town. First buy a dried shroom, then buy a dusty hammer. Okay, dried shroom, dusty hammer, in that order. And at the shop here only. Well, it's the only shop. But yeah, you have to do it here. That was weird. That, was, that wasn't weird or anything, was it? I don't know. Okay, um, let me see right that way get our room in the item. But seriously, how does Mario carry that I that many items? Does he have like a little um, slave or something that's carrying items or something? Or does he have like magical pockets? He can fit everything he wants. Just keep going up, man. But anyway, so totally and cool, man. Okay. But see that little thing back there? Yeah. But oh, get over here. See back there, right there. By that, if you go down or go up. You can see a little secret thing that basically gives you. Well, you'll find out for yourself. But I already powered my up myself off. So oh my god! You red nasty thing! How dare you deceive me? How dare you! What? I have a feeling. The pole stone. So we got the pole stone. And so, yeah. Man, I hate to go. Hmm. 
But so what we want to do is go out in the desert. Um, and base and the full stone will like a like um a pulse or something. It'll go tick 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 The pulse will go faster and faster once you get closer to him then or you could just follow me and do what I'm doing. You don't have to use the pulse stone yourself. That's okay. But I might be doing Super Mario, Super Mario Galaxy 2. But for a blind let's play, <laughs> I know a blind let's play. That's gonna be hard. But if I could beat this first Super Mario Galaxy easy, then I'm sure I might be able to do this one as easy. So yeah, that'll be my first blind let's play. So. This has been Magic Kirby 64, and in the next episode, we shall go in here. I'm the huge, scary Totem Koopa, Rammerless King of the Desert. Ah, uh, I thought Master Fighter was King of the Desert. Whatever. <laughs>